he just went straight show like the whole time. Mm -hmm. And I, I wonder if that's just because it's like I'm going to practice under a pressure base situation and that'll help me get better. And there we go. Hey Wario. See okay. that's what I thought because this is a this is one of DK's worst matchups in general. Because Fox Strave oppresses DK extremely well. Oh, yeah. And also in the air especially, DK just cannot, cannot land. Oh yeah. That's always been what his like one of his worst things about DK is that he has a pre some pretty bad landing options. This yeah. game's a bit better because he can like you can reverse the down B and like make some recovery that way and it's still and that, it works. It's not like something you do every time, but it definitely works. It's there. And fastball it's in there as well, too. But yeah, yeah, fastball in there seems kind of like high up as a hitbox, so you do have to be really careful. It doesn't last as long as in the last game, but it's, it's still like the best option that DK has for landing, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. But it's what it is. Yeah, in this case, you got the Warrior, though. It's not a character I know, I, I know pretty well, actually. Mm. As you were so saying, yeah. uh, like Fox does not let many characters land, and I think having the bike is a really nice thing to be able to just kind of get away. Oh, definitely. Yeah, Warrior's got a lot of options, actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, Warrior's ridiculous. Oh, yes. Yeah, so that neutral, I, I, he has a lot of really quick options, like especially that neutral air, that forward air, which people overrate because it's not actually that powerful. <laughs> but, mm. yeah, it's yeah. just good off stage sometimes. Yeah, forward air, it's just kind of like a good poke, and it's it's nice and fast, so. Yeah, and also you can, like, confirm it and stuff at low percents and confirm, like, a crab, for instance. Yeah, that's true, that's true. It can trip. Mm -hmm. That's always it nice. It can trip? Ooh, yeah. I don't think that happened before. I play Warrior a lot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've, I've seen a trip. Weird. It like low, low percent though. Makes sense. Okay. Oh, but Ian's, look, Ian's looking for us though. Oh, taking that bike. Nope. That makes you very, you're very exposed. You're very much exposed when you take that bike in general. Ooh, Just nice like you would for a regular item in like a regular game. Mm. Like if you pick up a box, for instance, like it's basically the same thing. In this case, Warrior has that frame five, I think, a dash tag, which is. That's frame five. It. It's frame five. Oh my god. Yeah, down tilt dash tag. That's what Warriors work for a lot. Of this percents. It's got or just a raw dash tag in general. I think it's ridiculous. It's got the janky hitbox too. It lasts forever. <laughs> yeah, it's good stuff. Yeah, and even like the, the, the like the the secondary hitbox line in the first place. This is actually pretty good too. It sends you a, a good angle for anything else. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Warriors just got a good kit in general. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy with all his buffs. I didn't like him in Smash Four like pretty much at all. In this game, I. Like I like Warrior a lot as a character. I like all the Warrior games, like all the Warrior wears, Warrior lands, and all that. And uh, like, I'm glad that I can finally play Warrior in this game, and, and he's like good. <laughs> Four words: <laughs> three frame jump squat. Yeah, huge difference. Oh, right now, who speaking of jumps, we were getting jumped all over with these up airs. Oh, another up tilt. That was not what you wanted to see. Nice forward air though. Yeah, Very good little. Good. I, I wonder if that uh, that like actually. Oh, there we go. Yeah, the classic Nair to up smash. We all know it. Yeah, we all fear it. I feel like Warrior can probably get Fox, like, after our Fox off stage by doing a downer. I'm not sure if that's true or not, but I think it might be a thing if he, like, times it correctly. I mean, downer will mess you up at that percentage, but yeah, we got the oh, dash yeah. attack. Everyone missed that shoulder attack. I did, too. I missed it so much. Oh, yeah. All right. so good. So I did like the trip in the last game where he, like, falls in his face because it jab locks, which is pretty nice. Mm. That's why, like, how a lot of like Warrior Man's the whole like footstool thing. It's got for that. God, or you get like instant dash attack. It's oh my god, that just seems scary. Oh, we got the down oh. air. I thought we were gonna see another up smash. Yeah, so, we'll see it soon probably. Yeah, I don't think he was at the percentage, nor did he have enough rage to finally take that one out. Yeah, where's where's very there heavy, but is. up smashes no. I don't care about your weight. <laughs> and he di'd the holy hell out of that, mm -hmm. and he <laughs> he still he still ate a ate an L. Well, I'm seeing as a player, it's a very mix up oriented player in general, which is why some like Warrior suits him because... Warrior's a good player for that. Yeah, and DK as well too, because like, they have a lot of power and like, a big, a big way to play him in general is play more, is like, is like, kind of turning him on and off offensively, in a way, if that makes any sort of sense. Like, like you have to go, you have to go like in for a while, you have to be very aggressive, then eventually just fall back and then just... Oh yeah, you like, condition them. Yeah, you condition them, basically. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That sort of thing. Because you always expect them to just come up with an up air or something like ridiculous. And, and I feel like that's like the best way to play like either one of these characters in this case. Yeah, I think Donkey Kong is a really good example of that too. It's especially against a character like Fox, like, as you mentioned, it's a pretty bad matchup. I could see it happening because Fox doesn't let people land in general. So when you look at the character like Donkey Kong? If Fox just do stuff like that, just calm them to 60 because it's a big body. Yeah, the that the character is, has a great advantage state, but is disadvantage. Much to be desired, to say the least. Yeah, we need to see if uh, if YMCA is able to put Eon into his shield, because then he can start oh, going for those but, grabs. 
Ah, oh, just out, of, just out of percent because of the rage. Yeah, I like that idea with the down B though, just in case he phantasmed into and it. And that'll do it. Yeah, yeah. Go for the forward throw though. That's a bit more knockback on actually. I'll than tell you, down throw. I'll tell you what, man. If you play Fox, you learn how to di. You learn how to di real quick mm -hmm. because you are always trying to move. You're always trying to do attacks, and eventually you'll get hit out of one of them, and they may kill you. Yeah, he's a really light character. Okay. Nice. Wow. Is that a zero with 41? Yeah. Oh my god. He can do more as well, too, if he, gets, if he gets the land there. So like, much power. On a stage like, on a stage like this, he wants to use the platforms to his advantage more than anything else. Either like staying on the platforms, like doing up tilt to like keep it in the air and just go for more up airs, or just like. Or just like. I don't know. Just, as Fox? No, as a uh, DK in this as, case. Oh, yeah, yeah. His up tilt is really huge and. It's just like it's hard to catch with all those up airs with Donkey Kong because of the the air mobility that Fox has, and that's uh, that's another factor that makes this matchup so freaking difficult. You're talking about that zero death again just did there as well. <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> when I see the one the, the one combo, Ooh. oh Ooh. that was beautiful. That was good. There's uh, nowhere to have gone there. Yeah, that was pretty uh, pretty schmexy. Yeah. Oh, okay. The roll behind. I thought we were gonna see the grab because uh, YMCA was pretty solidified in that shield there. Very Good nice first down B there. Mm. That's what that's what he needed. Oh, the down tilt or down air. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, we're setting up for these up smashes, getting ready to go. That's a good mix up there in the ledge there. Going going for Nair onto the ledge instead of just like grabbing the ledge instead. Mm. I liked good. what I, I liked what I saw there from uh, YMCA. He was using the down uh, the down B to try to like cover uh, roll, and he did. Yeah, that is super good now. Mm. Used to be not be that aerial damage used to not be too useful in general. Oh, oh. just off mark. Yeah. But now you can just create a combo into a oh. lot. Oh, punch in the back of the head. Not enough just yet though. Not from across the stage. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Oh, you know what? His face to the left. That was it. Yeah, Eon actually messed up there. He could have gotten the up smash, and that could have been it. Oh, oh. There we go. There I would have go. gone to the back here. Go, go to the ledge there. Man. That was that was still super nice. That might have been a little scary for Eon because that was his last dog. Mm -hmm. Ooh boy, very yeah. very good effort there from YMCA. That's yeah, a, it's a it's a hard matchup to say at least. Yeah.